Hi, my beautiful Pisces. How are you? If you're new, how welcome. My name is Michelle, and this is your weekly reading. Before I start, I want to remind you guys that my readings have no date today. Are divinely guided. Everything has free will, and everything is going to resonate with everybody. And please keep in mind that rules give you rest between you and your person. And with that said, let's move forward. Again, these are all general. If you wonder why I'm wearing this, it's my birthday this weekend, so I'm celebrating beforehand. So with that said, let's move forward. I'm going to be 29, Pisces. Can you believe that? 29. Incredible. So with this said, let's see. The first card we got is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. We got the Eight of Pentacles here. One card at a time. Please and thank you, Spirit. Let's see. We have the Six of Pentacles in reverse, the Moon in reverse. We have Page of Candles, Page of Wands in reverse, Chariot in reverse. Okay. We have the World in reverse, Wheel of Fortune in reverse, and overall energy. We have the Eight of Wands in reverse. Mm and three of cups at the bottom so we have a lot of pisces cancer scorpio where the moon is focusing on you we have cancer energy uh we have leo sagittarius aries over and over and over again a lot of fire there's a lot of fire so this is a lot of suppressed fire here so i feel somebody who you share this intense fire this intense connection with you guys have been suppressing that they could also be suppressing this for a long time I feel like it's like a ticking bomb at this point, a ticking thingy, because I feel like it's something that is about to explode. Like, it's like a surprise. Like, whoa, you can't. It's like you're not seeing, you're not surprised, but you didn't see it coming the moment it happened. So I feel like this is long overdue as it's been suppressed for so long. Um, you and this individual have been ignoring each other, have been ignoring each other. There's no communication from either or. I feel like I don't see this person being blocked. I don't see you being blocked anymore. I feel like the 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 mutual energy of ignoring each other because it feels like you both are waiting for the other person to reach out as well. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I feel that it hasn't paid off because you have little to no communication with this person. Now, I get people who tell me, oh, not, it's not for me. I'm talking to them. Then why are you watching tarot readings? You and I know that you are not talking to them. So you are not talking to them or little to no communication, okay? Um, there's nothing much besides nothing, to be honest. Um, I think things are not over. It's just like, it's hard to say. It's like it has no date. It has no no answer. I feel like undefined is undefined all of it is undefined i i feel like it's it's not a, it's not over but yet it hasn't started so it's hella confusing here you both want this to work you both are wanting to have a reunion a reconciliation yet you both are not talking to one another Somebody, I feel like, look, this is a lot of emotions here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This is a lot of emotions here. This person thinks of you a lot. This person, when they drink, somebody drinks, they think about the other person a lot. <laughs> Hold on. So, that's what I was saying. Somebody has a lot of emotions, and I feel like they drink. And when they drink, they get in their feelings, and they go like, damn. All I want is Pisces. Pisces and I should have been together. Like, they wonder a lot about you. I feel like you're going to have a surprise message from them a lot. I feel like they are in their feelings and especially when they drink, um, definitely there's going to be a text message coming forward or a communication coming for, for, forward from, from them. Um, this is going to be uh, an emotional heart to heart conversation or an emotional heart to heart message. I feel like they're going to tell you how they've been feeling all this time. There's definitely communication coming from them towards you out of nowhere it's going to actually lift a lot of burdens um this could be an apology as well coming towards you this could be you apologizing to them i'm not sure this could be mutual as well um something about a october 31st is 
it's it's actually being refer referenced here uh maybe your person has kids you have kids um it seems to be that there is referencing uh october and december and kids so either or they have kids you have kids or you guys have mutual kids you know together so i feel like there is a specific holiday here that is gonna either or i feel like it's gonna like bring you guys together or it's like a started starter conversation here um but even if you guys have kids or not it's something re referencing those two two months specifically um this person hasn't been uh very active in their social medias because your person has been working a lot um you're gonna find it very surprising to know what they do for for a living um things have changed a lot of things have changed in their life so you gotta be they're gonna you're gonna be catched up you guys have a lot of catch up together but it seems to me that you guys still have the energies and possibilities of making this work i feel like you guys feel like oh my god i'm too old or it's too late it doesn't give me that it gives me that still a chance uh you guys have to see this in a different perspective you guys have to treat this differently of course you guys cannot act the same way and maybe whatever you guys did in the past cannot be done again but it's definitely a chance at do over you guys still have a chance to make this work with them there's still a possibility to go somewhere with them it's not giving it's over completely so it's pretty much at the side if you want to make it work or not of course but it's giving me that it's still it's still a possibility how is this person feeling towards pisces with three cards they have been uh spying on your profiles uh this could be a fake profile as well uh, it seems to be that they could have changed their phone number or so. So they're watching you from a different profile and or they could be calling you from a private number, but it's them. Uh, this person um, still likes you. They still have feelings for you. They have been definitely spying, like snooping around in your social medias or something like that. Um, they don't want you to know because they have a lot of pride. They don't want you to know. So they have been very sneaky, very good at being sneaky. Um, your person has been very patient uh they have been working on themselves too because they know damn well that they have things to work on as well but they still have hope look at this they still have a lot of hope that you guys can make it work they have not lost hope and don't be telling me oh tell them to stop like you tell them i'm not a mailman baby if you don't want them to have hope with you tell them in their face but the lovers in reverse gemini energy you guys are connected energetically like attached to the hip energetically and i feel like you guys are each other's dream girl or dream guy you guys are definitely uh the dream person for one another there is still fear there is fear and pride and pride in the way in this connection this mutual okay this is mutual here fear and pride but the same way there's a lot of love here i want to say that it's not perfect and somebody here feels that the other person is too attractive for the other person i don't know who feels this way but also it's like insecurities also getting in the way but you secretly want this as much as they do and i feel like you both know that there's a lot to work and a lot to fix but the love and the hope it's mutual here even if you tell me it's not the cards don't lie what is holding back pisces person thank you so much they're entangled they couldn't meet somebody new and they got themselves entangled but it seems to be that they got somebody new for I wouldn't say just entertainment, but loneliness. They're not in love with them the way they're in love with you. They also feel like you don't want them anymore. They also feel like you hate them for some reason. Even if you, they, they feel like you hate them. Okay. They feel like you do not want them anymore. But at the same time, they're holding hope. It's a weird thing.
their pride has held them back a lot. Their um, insecurities have held them back a lot. They have a lot of money issues as well. And if they had kids, they have a lot of money issues in you know livelihood so that shit got like is a third factor that hold them back from focusing in the connection again um your person can also deal with anxiety and depression so i feel like a lot of things besides uh insecurities hold them back there's a lot of things about this person that you don't really know um you don't know at all 100 percent. so just FYI. They also got surgery of some sort, by the way, for some of you. Um, there was uh, They were in a legal situation as well. But 100% is the fact that they don't have the courage or the balls to tell you that they, they still want this because they fear rejection, your rejection. A lot of things, like I said, but... One of the things is fear of rejection. They're like cowards. What is the overall outcome here? I feel like they're preparing themselves. There's some momentum happening. There's some momentum happening. It's not going to be fast, but your person is fixing themselves. They're actually trying to figure it out. Their economical situation is also hunting like like haunting them but you know holding them back there's gonna be a overnight transformation and this could be a drunk text message uh they could be very emotional that night and just text you um i feel like again the full and reverse aries energy is not somebody new so it's somebody that you definitely know This person could, uh, I would say, like, not only, not a witch, but they could actually be into, like, you know, tarot as well. Or even, like, in this, they could be a pagan or something like that. I'm not sure. This person seems to be, like, having red hair. They dyed their hair red. Or they have red hair or blonde hair. One of the two colors. Uh, they could be a little bit older than you. Like, a year, two, three years the most. Um, they actually been healing a lot of things in their in themselves um they have a lot of scarring because they're being healing they're also working on their health and i feel like they've been working on their career a lot um they have not stopped wanting you you guys have not been separated completely energetically there's still something with the emperor and reverse areas energy they just don't have the courage but i also feel like maybe for some of you december will be an important day that you guys could either or see each other or come forward but there's definitely uh unfinished business here between you two and i feel like you guys the shit has been going for too far and this stopping on the holding back stopping on the stalking each other or stalking you and i feel like there's gonna be an important action taken towards the connection so i feel like a surprise comeback from somebody who is swallowing their pride and it seems to be an air sign so they're definitely coming forward with actions and i feel like it's gonna fix try to fix the situation um so be ready that yeah there's action from them towards you it's gonna be an important action so overall they're coming back they're coming with action this communication so you'll hear from them So let's see what initials there is. Keep in mind that this could be the first, last, middle, or even a nickname. I should do this. My back is hurting. Let's see. Let's see. W as in William, J as in Jason, S as in Sam, F as in Frank, U as in Umbrella, A as in Apple, Q as in Kessel, Y as in Yes, H as in Hamburger, C as in Cat, C as in Zebra, O as in Oscar, E as in Edwin, P as in Patrick, I as in Ian, let's see, anything else, K as in KFC, N as in Nina, L as in Leo, and T as in Tyler. I know I give a lot, but I just talk to multiple people, so I make sure to give options. So, these are the options that I was able to find. So they're coming forward with communication. Now, 
let's see what the final message here is gonna be hold on let's see what spiritual animals i can give you so you want to actually find the meaning of such animal the one that you feel the most drawn to so you can find it online and it'll take it'll give you extra guidance maybe towards this connection maybe towards something else sorry for the interruptions but i have a son he's three so he was just throwing things around i'm like no so let's see what is the spiritual animal that i can give you pisces let's see what we got here so at the bottom we got the camel right here we got zebra we have a beaver we have a sea serpent we got a cosmic egg we got a dragon and last one we got horse so make sure to find the spiritual meaning of the animal you felt the most drawn to because you'll get extra guidance so with this said pisces this is the end of your reading thank you so much for watching me please do not forget to like and subscribe and if you want to win a free reading make sure to subscribe to my channel as every time my channel gains a thousand subscribers i host a free reading giveaway right now i might do it this week or next because i'm waiting for my channel to get the numbers once i do i'm going to make a video so i can give you guys the info what i'm offering i also have a new thing coming up for my subscribers which is uh starting october is going to happen once a month towards the end of the month i want to choose one lucky subscriber to give um to choose so i can make a video i want to dedicate them a video so i'm going to give them a reading and i'm going to post it here as a thank you for everybody who follows me so it's going to happen once a month so you want to be able to be considered who knows you may win make sure to subscribe to my channel i also most likely show you my social medias so um if you follow me on instagram i always follow back i have a tiktok i have a new project coming up which is a podcast hopefully next week i can do it i also have a small group on facebook um i also do personal reading so if you want one with me make sure to go to the link which is going to be on the description box below i only take readings there so if the if you don't reach out to me there uh, i don't take readings i don't take or accept requests through messages or emails or dms as i said before it's only through the website uh with this said i do not offer any free reading anywhere else so i've never messaged anybody anywhere offering anything either so if that were to happen it's not me report and block but with that said thank you so much for watching me thanks for the support and again thank you thank you thank you have an amazing day pisces Stay sexy. Stay sexy.